Okay guys, this is how it works. We are on a flat earth plane. All compasses point to the center of this flat earth plane. The center is the North Pole, the magnetic north. There is a north star above the magnetic north and coming from the ground up is the aurora borealis and it comes shooting out from the center it hits the top of the dome and comes showering down creating the matrix code it is unbelievably hard for people to accept this and in most cases they think it's absolutely ridiculous and have a good laugh but they won't be laughing in a short time from now. The, once the uh, truth comes out, which has already started, that we're living on a flat earth plane, this can't be hidden. The technology is just getting too much. There's too many people that have the tech now. And uh, they're going to find out that it's flat. And then there may be people that find out that it's flat and stop there, and that's it. Eh, we don't care. Eh, it doesn't matter. But the average person, once they realize that it's flat, they're not going to want to stop there. They're going to want to dig. They're going to want to know, what the fuck am I living in? Right? Because the whole concept of space and this massive distance between us and stars and these giant planets that are way off in the distance. It's all moot. None of it matters. What's going to matter is the truth. And whether the truth is brought to us, you know, by a guy that claims to be Satan, or a guy that claims to be Jesus, or a guy that claims to be whatever, it doesn't matter. Well, the truth is the truth. And anything built on a foundation of lies is doomed to fall. And the truth will always rise up. The interesting thing about immortality, it's a very interesting word, immortality can only exist when it's based on truth. You say, how is that possible? That doesn't make any sense. Well, it does, actually. For something that is based on lies, a lie can be stretched out for a long time. But it becomes weak and has faults. And those faults surface. And when that happens, it just crumbles apart. But something that's built on the foundation of the truth has no faults, it cannot crumble because it's built on a solid structure. And something that's built on a solid structure from the beginning will be built on a solid structure until the end. But because it's built on a solid structure, there is no beginning, there is no end, there's just eternity. The very concept of a beginning and an end only begins with a lie.